Alrighty guys, we're starting to get together some parts for our water wheel. Here's what I'm thinking. This is um, old cable reels from the phone company where I work. Um, so basically, they would look like those. Um, this is one seven and a half foot reel here on the bigger one, seven and a half feet. And the other one's five feet. My thought is to um, make it so it's only a foot wide. So instead of it being like that four foot, um, have it be about a foot wide or 10 inches, whatever a five gallon bucket is, have it be that wide. Um, so basically cut down these, these things that go in the middle. Those uprights right there, those are going to be, so cut those down so they're 10 inches. Uh, weld it back together, make it 10 inches wide, and then take that five foot, that five and a half foot round reel, and line it up so the, the middle sprocket, you know, is all lined up, so it's balanced. But have that actually as my pulley. Um, I just, I don't know how fast I can get this thing to spin off the creek. So I actually, I can always slow it down, can't speed it up. So if I had that big of a pulley at the water wheel end, and then have it go down to a permanent magnet um, generator, um, which I found one on, um, it's, it's 10,000 to I think 20,000 um, watt, three phase, I found it on Amazon for like 300 bucks or something like that, which I thought was pretty good price, I don't know. This, this I'm kind of going in this one blind. I don't really know what I'm doing here. I'm just kind of designing engineering on the fly. Um, I guess my biggest question right now is what to use for the axle or the spindle in the middle. Um, so I'm going to basically, if I have one of those five footers on both sides of the, the outsides of the seven and a half foot reels, um, I could, in theory, put two generators on if I ever wanted. But that would, you know, balance it and and have, I don't know, 16 or 20 buckets going around this thing. Probably not that many, probably probably 12 buckets maybe going around the 7 foot inside to catch the water. You know, to make actually make it spin. Anyway, that's the start of my project. Um, do you guys have any comments or any ideas for what to use for the, the main axle or um, spindle? And the bearing setup, I'd be open to some suggest suggestions. Anyway, guys, that's uh, the start of the, uh, the project of the water wheel. Um, go ahead and hit a like and uh, subscribe for the so you don't miss out on the next uh, video when we make it. Thanks for watching. Have a good day.